1995, I was sentenced to life in prison for a first time nonviolent drug offense. And December 18th, 2015, I received a letter from President Obama. He was telling me he believed in me and that um, he was giving me um, second chance. Ramona Brandt is serving life without parole. She's a first offender. She was a victim of domestic abuse. The United States accounts for 5% of the world's population. We account for 25% uh, of the world's inmates. I am commuting the sentences of 46 prisoners who were convicted many years or in some cases decades ago. <laughs> The father of my children was a drug dealer. He ended up getting arrested. My being ignorant to the law, I was relying on his knowledge to help me understand what was going on. So I believed in the justice system. I believe I had the opportunity to go to the courts. I had a right for trial. And in the end, I was found guilty. I've never sold drugs at all in my life. Overall, being present, when certain um, acts was committed, I was held responsible for that. But I never gave up hope. I never gave up the faith that one day God was gonna bring me through this because I could not mentally comprehend doing life in prison for a first time nonviolent drug case. No one can make me accept that. As all of you know, it has been one of my top priorities for us to uh, bring about a more sensible, more effective uh, approach to our criminal justice system, uh, particularly when... On March 30th, I went and had lunch with President Obama. It was surreal. The motorcade pulls up, the president steps out of his car, and he turns to me and he says, Hey, Ramona, come on, I'm taking you to lunch. And I'm like, that was when I told him, I will not allow your name to be tainted by anything that I do. I will honor you with my freedom. And that's what I've done. In the 21 years, I missed the opportunity to be a mother to my own children. However, I'm home today. Things that I missed out on were very important moments in my life. The things that I'm grateful for is the opportunity to create images from this day forward. And President Obama, he know he gave me a second chance, but I don't think he knows the depth of what this really means to be free.